Hey everyone, in today's video, I wanna show you exactly how to delete multiple emails in Outlook if you use Outlook as your email service provider. Now, I also recently posted a video showing you how to unsubscribe from unwanted emails. So make sure to check that out after this video to keep your inbox clean. Now, there are many reasons why you wanna delete messages inside of your inbox. With email service providers like Gmail and Outlook, they typically give you 15 gigabytes of free storage. And in some cases, you may be reaching that limit. So it's always a good idea to delete unwanted or old emails so you could free up more storage. Now, personally, I love to keep a clean inbox because it just makes me more productive. And I also make sure I don't miss important messages by just having a lot of cluttered inside of my mailbox. So with all that said, let me show you exactly how to delete all or multiple emails in Outlook. I'll show you here on the web app and then I'll show you the mobile app as well. Now, just a quick warning before we jump in. Once you delete emails, it's typically irreversible. So it's gonna be a permanent action. So double check, triple check, make sure the emails that you are deleting are the ones you definitely wanna delete. Now, in an upcoming video, I will cover more advanced things like filters, also known as rules, that let you sort your emails. But for now, let's jump in and delete our emails. For the very first option for deleting all or multiple emails in Outlook, let me show you the most straightforward option. I just logged into my Outlook here on the web app. So I just opened a browser window, went to Outlook, signed in. And to select multiple emails to delete, select the first one here by clicking the check mark next to it. And then you hold down shift on your keyboard and go all the way down. I'll go all the way down to here. Click again while I'm holding shift on my keyboard and it will select all these at the same time. Now I could press delete on my keyboard to delete all these emails, or I could just press delete on top here on this top menu. I'll press it and it's going to move it here into my deleted items into the trash can. Now, if I wanna permanently delete them from here, I could just right click here and empty this folder. This will empty the trash can and these will be permanently deleted. Now, if I change my mind for the next 30 days, if I don't delete the trash can, I could recover these deleted items from here. Another option you have that I personally like is just deleting an entire folder of emails. So first, let's go ahead and create a new folder. Typically under folders, you'll see new folder, just click that. And this is what you want to delete. So I'm just gonna name this delete these. And you could name it obviously anything you want, like I have one for coupons. And all I need to do now is the same thing I did before. I could select using shift multiple emails I want to delete, and then I'll drag them to this folder. Now, if I, again, go into this folder, I could right click on this folder and do the same thing I did with the trash can, which is empty this folder. And it's going to let me delete all these emails. I like this option because I'm double checking here. I'm moving things from my inbox into this delete folder. So then I make sure everything that made it here actually got a second look before I permanently delete it. Now you could do the exact same thing on your Android or iPhone in the Outlook app. So let me quickly show you that as well. And then I'll show you more advanced options. Now the Outlook app on iPhone and Android is the same. So to delete emails here, again, I'm gonna go ahead and select one of them. Okay, and then you could select multiple emails just using this option right here and pressing delete on the bottom or you could select everything by just pressing this option right here and you select it all in view here and then you could press this trash icon on the bottom. One more method for deleting emails in Outlook and I'm talking about Microsoft provided email addresses like at Outlook or at Hotmail is by using a third party app like Clean Email. Now you could use Clean Email in combination with the Outlook app to make this process much smoother. With Clean Email, you could do a lot more to keep your inbox clean and it's gonna give you some options that are just not available with the Outlook app. First, you could use the link in the description to jump into Clean Email here and you could sign in and you could connect your Outlook or Hotmail inbox here. And I'm gonna go ahead and log into that. The very first option that I often use is called Quick Clean. Now with Quick Clean, you could save a lot of time. What this option does is it puts everything into these categories. Emails that are older than seven days, for example, or miscellaneous notification show up over here as well. Now this allows you to remove everything such as social media notifications here just with one click and move them to the trash. Now the second option here that is very useful is called Smart View. So if you look here on the left side, all your emails will get categorized into these broad categories under Smart View. So for example, emails that come from a dead end show up in their own folders. And typically you don't need to keep these. 
so you could select them and move them to the trash just from right here. It will also create these other categories like finance, for example, or travel or social media notifications. So you could select any of these broad categories here and delete all things from this page as well. Now, that's one of my favorite ways for deleting multiple emails at once using the Smart View. And the third option, and one of my favorites, is called Auto Clean, which will show up over here. And you only need to set this up one time and it will work in the background. Let me show you how it works. For Auto Clean, I will go to my inbox, for example, or unread emails. I will select just one email that I want to delete from a sender. But instead of pressing delete, I'm gonna press Auto Clean instead. What Auto Clean lets me do is it lets me apply a rule. So for example, in this case, I want to delete this email. So I'm gonna choose an action down here, which is move to trash. So this email is gonna to go to trash, but here's the most important part. Apply to all existing and future emails. If you select this, you no longer have to manually do this. This rule will be applied to all existing emails from this sender and all future emails from this sender. And I could create and run this rule right now. Now, if I go to my auto clean section right here, I could see all the rules that I've set up previously. I could delete them if I change my mind or just put them on pause. I have a link in the description with a discount code applied if you wanna try clean email out for yourself. And it's really that easy to delete all or multiple emails inside of Outlook and I hope you found this video useful. Make sure you hit the notification bell and subscribe to this channel so you don't miss the next video and I will see you next time. Thanks for watching.